Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. Today I am super excited because I had an idea. I am going to make an American flag. Now I'm just I already rolled it out on the thickest the thickest setting and we're just gonna fold it in half and press it down to connect the two to get it as thick as my little rolls here that I've already done. And I just took and rolled pieces out. Pretty simple, really easy. And that's not straight. So we're gonna straighten that out. So we're gonna make this a little smaller because I don't want it to be this big. So we're just gonna chop off some ends to give it some size. Okay. Now that should work just fine. It still gives us some room to put in the little stars. So we're going to start out with this red. I'm going to roll it out a little bit. Put that there. Now this is the tricky part. Not getting the red on the white is going to be a little difficult, which I'm not too, too worried about doing it because I know it's going to happen anyway. Okay, so we're just going to slide this one up to that one, like that, and wipe my hands off with a baby wipe. And then we're going to move on to the next longest piece of red, and just gently rolling it. Okay, there we go. I'm going to place that one up next to that one, and then wipe our hands off because it was red. <laughs> handy dandy roller wipe it off with a clean baby wipe because I'm out of alcohol <laughs> wipe it off get it all clean and then dry it with a paper towel and I'm gonna go from the side and just press down just to get everything lined up. Okay, that looks good. Um, now I'm gonna take my blade, if I can remember where I placed it, underneath my wipe, and I'm gonna wipe it off because it still has some blue on it, and dry it. Careful. All right. And we're going to go down the side of the blue here and carefully press down and get the excess off. And that's one side. I'm going to do this side. Just like so. And there we go. It's an American flag. That was pretty fun. Pretty fun to make. Just gonna straighten off the bottom. <laughs> That's awesome. All right, and I'm gonna take some of this white I have and make my little stars. And it's okay if it has some waves in it. It's clay and a flag has waves in it. It's not perfect. Okay, I'm gonna try it, there we go. All right, so there's our flag part. I'm going to clean my hands and start on the stars. And here's our white here. Let me 
wipe this down here and we're going to put our stars on. Now what I'm going to do, I think the best way to accomplish this, they're not going to be star stars, they're just going to be little dots and I think that would be the best way to execute it. I have done putting in all my indentions for my little stars here and now we're going to place them all in. Yes, there are 50 indentions. It was a little hard to get the alignment right. I know that there's six and then five and then six and five, but you see here, it kind of goes in a little bit on the bottom. It's, it's fine, <laughs> but I'm going to take our little balls of white that I've made and start placing them in. is our American flag from polymer clay <laughs> it is my first try at this guys so I'm pretty sure with more practice I can get better at it but this is what we got this will be a Father's Day present for my husband we're gonna stick it on the fridge to honor him and serving our country but I want to thank you guys so so much for watching me today and I hope you enjoyed it and I hope to see some of you try this for yourself because this is really simple and I could have done better and I will clean it up with when I get some alcohol um, but for now that is all I have for you today and I'll see you next time